now i would like to call our president who will take the meeting further please welcome our president pm santosh ibrahim to call meeting in order please welcome him with huge around applause thank you so much thank you so much thank you so much to master wasim for that wonderful intro and this 37th meeting of the bitp toastmasters is called to order uh, vice president education and bp membership are there first yeah hello everyone good evening of the day this is me ishrat fatima i have been invited by mohammed bakhar who is a member of your club and okay. i am an area dfi director at district 101 and presently here is the eliza from singapore from johari to master bilingual club i was okay. invited by mohammad vikar actually i met him the second time now last time you visit uh -huh. singapore also uh -huh. and uh, hello everyone my name is uh, mohammad hadil madhoub i was invited by toast master mahmud and uh, i am here to uh, enjoy your privileged assembly with your blessed faces everybody Hi. Uh, my name is Kauta Rasfor, project manager at Khalij Commercial Bank uh, in IT department. Okay. I am. Uh, well, I'm. I'm a member of this club um, in London. Obviously. Yes. I'm very pleased to be here. I'm going to be the evaluator for the first speech. Thank you, Master Muhammad Vikar. Agenda is adopted by Toastmaster Vikaruddin. Would somebody else suggest uh, second it, please? The brethren, I'm seconding it. All right, the, our IPP, Mr. Khalid, that seconded it. So with that, let's move on with the meeting. Today, our theme for the meeting is about mental health. It in in connection with the World Mental Health Day. You know, emotional and mental health. is of prime importance and it's because a vital part of our lives and impacts our thoughts our behavior and our emotions you know the experts say that there are a lot of steps by which we can improve our emotional and mental health and they say there are little things which you can do little things like doing some exercises little things that that you know by adjusting your diet and maybe sharing out your thoughts and sharing out your views with others taking a break whenever necessary and you know if they also say that it will be nice if you could sleep well and you know uh, all those there's a lot of tips on top of all that one of the tips that stands out well is to you need to connect with other people now if i tell you that being a member of tours masters will help you increase your you are not just your communication leadership but can improve your mental and emotional health you would say that i am campaigning for toast masters because i am a member of toast masters and i am a president of a club but do you know the fact is that the experts say that one of the best way to improve your emotional mental health is by volunteering okay volunteering is is one of the best ways is an essential part of toast masters suppose you are taking off a small role in toast masters meeting like an accountant's role or uh, a role with regard to uh, being the tier body for the day or the role to be any evaluator or anything else you are actually what you're doing is you are volunteering to help to advance the skills of yourself and others if you take up a club officer's role like a president as i am or a vice president or any other club officers or excom role you are actually volunteering to help to make this club better and subsequently you are helping to make the toastmasters experience better for everybody so being a toastmaster is not just improving your skills you will excel and when you excel you transfer the benefit to others to by helping them to excel you know for my members the word volunteering just means helping or distributing food to others or helping the needy but volunteering is actually willfully doing anything without expecting a financial reward back and i should say volunteers are the core of every toastmasters meeting you know so there's something great about our one of our past international presidents called pa btm dilip abeshegra is something wonderful that he said he said people find 
fulfillment when they are contributing to the lives of others. Wow, people find fulfillment when they're contributing to the lives of others. You know, science, scientists at Stanford University at Palo Alto, California did a research. You know what the research was? They got a group of people over the age of 70 years and they did this research and they concluded that volunteers tend to live longer years than non-volunteers. Wow. Toasters, masters have been provided, have long provided, have provided a social outlet for its members in addition to the important professional and personal skill advancement. And the Toastmasters brings together a group of wonderful, remarkable, you know, uh, supportive people of common interests. And I should, from my experience, tell you, we have found and my experience, I've been, I've been a member of Toastmasters since 2002. I found some wonderful friends in this Toastmasters community. So it's a great networking platform. It's a great platform to meet across so people of different domains. And this Toastmasters movement formed by Dr. Ralph C. Smedley in Santa Ana, California in 1924 has now got 3,58,000 members spread across 143 countries. Toastmasters offers us an opportunity to grow and excel to our highest levels. And once you reach that level, you realize that it is not about yourself. It is about what you can do for others. And when you try to help others, you get a very rich satisfaction. And I'm telling you, that satisfaction is one of the reasons why they say volunteering will help your mental and emotional health. And you know, Thanks to science, we now that know that being a member of Toastmasters, you can also have healthier and longer lives too. So that's one, one small new addition of knowledge that I can give you as, and the, as we celebrate this World Peace or Mental Day. And uh, uh, with that, I would like to welcome all of you again to the 37th meeting of the Bari IT Professionals Toastmasters meeting. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you so much. With that, I'd like to move on to the business session.